Hey guys, so really quick, I'm about to walk into um, one of the tile shops around here and <clears throat> one question um, that popped into my head. So when you're laying floor tiles, what what are the things that you do in, in order to prepare? So if it's, you know, on a wood floor, yeah, you know, you uh, whatever material you take up, you screw the uh, floorboards down, make sure they don't squeak, you make sure that it has the right thickness and all that. but what if you're doing it for a basement? You can't necessarily screw anything down in a basement or, um, you know, just go at it with a, a saw just to remove all the, all the old material. Well, depending on what it is, you can't use a saw. I take that back. But um, think about it this way for your floors, you know, tile, it needs to be very level, relatively level. It needs to be level, bottom line. But, um, in order to make in order to make a basement floor which is mostly concrete sometimes mostly concrete um in order to make that level what do you do you can use your floor uh, floor leveling compound or just you know go go over it with um call it a fine tooth comb if you want but just look at the detail if there's any cracks try to repair that well if there's cracks in your basement floor you have an issue that you need to address first but um uh, make sure there's you know there's no cracks it's relatively level and put some floor leveling compound on it just to make sure that you're going the extra step to make sure that whatever tile you put down are not gonna go like that. Make sure it's level 100%. Um, after that dries, um, you know, put your uncoupling uh, membrane down. Um, sometimes you can get away with it, but in my experience, removing tile off a basement, off a concrete floor without an, an, an uncoupling membrane is a pain in the you know what it's it's a royal pain you don't want to do that to the next person that has to take it up i mean it's not going to be your problem chances are but you don't want to do that to the person that's going to be taking it up because it's a fellow contractor or even who cares even if it's a if you, even if it's a fortune 500 company that lays tile it's still going to be one person doing it it's not going to be the whole company or the person called company doing it it's going to be one individual or a set of individuals doing that so you know just Throw them a bone. Be be kind to them. Whatever. Um, after you've after you've done that, you're pretty much on a on an okay level to um, put the put the mortar down and start tiling. You know, with your uh, with your leveling system, of course. So keep all those things in mind whenever you're um, removing stuff. Look at what they did. Whenever you're putting stuff down, try to do it right. At least, if not for you, just do it for the next person. If you're doing it for yourself, like if you're um, a DIY champion and you're going at it gung-ho even better make sure you do it right because if you sell your home or if your son or your grandson has to undo it make it easy on them save them save them a little extra stress all right that's my tip for today um, let me know what you think uh, I'll leave a comment or two or three whatever just leave comments um, and yeah keep on sharing all right we'll talk some more